Hi, it's me again with CorelDraw Tips and Tricks. In this video, I'm going to attempt to show you how to blend something and then change the blend afterwards to a different rotation or something like that. The blend tool is a really interesting tool. I'm going to take the polygon tool and I'm going to set it on a three-sided, four-sided, excuse me. And I am going to hold down the control button and that's basically a square. But then if I take the shape tool and hold down the control button so it comes in perfectly, you have that shape. Now it's perfect because it needs to be. If I didn't hold down this control button, I could be off one way or the other. But once I hit the control button, it'll go to an even item. I am going to control D and make a duplicate. While holding down the shift key, I'm going to get the two-sided arrow and just bring that in. Now I'm going to I'm going to change them both to black. I'm going to right-click black. I'm going to take the center one and I'm going to rotate it because it's a four-sided item. It'll rotate perfectly. Now we're going to take both of our items. We're going to go up to object and blend. 40 times might be too many, but you get this effect. Now, the reason for the video is you can select that item and still change the rotation. And I think it, the, the more you do, the worse it gets off because you get too many lines coming. When you sit, start seeing the lines there. And then there's a lot of things you can do with it. You don't have to keep it in the center. You can move it off here. I don't like that. But then it is a blend. So we need to go to object and break the blend apart. While it's still selected, go to object. And it's really, there's some groups in it, but we're going to group it. And now we can change and make it look like the original one I started with. With it selected, we're going to grab the interactive fill tool and go from there to there, and you've completely changed the look. Let's go green up here and put yellow here. Total different look. I don't know where you'd ever use that, but it's pretty cool. I mean, look at it with a black background. Anyway, just playing around. I hope that helped. Thank you for watching.